What's up, you guys? Welcome back and welcome if you're new. In today's video, I'm right here with my good friend, Steven. Hey, guys. And we're going to go ahead and be hitting Broken Arrow Trail right here in Arizona, Sedona. It's going to be an awesome time, right? Oh, yeah, dude. It's going to be the best. Heck, yeah. I can't wait. And today, he's going to be my guide. So let's get it. Rocks. That's a nice boulder. <laughs> That's a nice boulder. I like, I like that, that boulder. boulder. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a picture. Oh, we know. Good. Oh. <laughs> All right, you guys, we are right here at Chicken Point in Broken Arrow Trail right here in Sedona. It's a freaking awesome view. If you guys do ever come out here, you guys will enjoy it. I can guarantee you guys that. Right now, we're going to go ahead and take a quick little hike up a little pass. You guys will see it in a minute. But overall, just looking at the views right here, this is a spot that you guys do want to go ahead and park, take a bunch of pictures, enjoy the nature, sit down. But one thing I do want to let you guys know, if you guys ever see the pink cheek tours out here, make sure to say hello to them and stay out of their way. All right, so as you guys can tell, our trucks are right there. Uh, so we're gonna be walking that white line. I was telling you guys uh, in a little bit, we'll kind of explain what the white line is, but we're gonna go ahead and get to it. If you guys do ever climb up here, bring a water because if you're fat like me, another set of lungs maybe. Yeah, you'll get you'll get really tired. Right now, me and Steve are kind of struggling. I am. Um, <laughs> I guess we are struggling. <laughs> so. <laughs> but Jesse, it's free. Jesse's bad with his words, guys. He doesn't know what he says half the time. I gotta translate them. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That is true. Uh, so yeah, but it's well worth it. Uh, if you guys are action seekers, uh, you guys will enjoy it. And I'll explain why in the next clip. So right now I'm gonna flip the camera and we'll show you guys. But you want to explain kind of what we're doing here and what uh -oh. it is exactly? Yeah, we're so we're walking what's called the Sedona White Line. And mountain bikers come up here for a thrill and they start where we are now and they they drop into the line here and they ride it across the rocks and they go down a little bit we'll get closer to it and then they come back it's like a hairpin turn and it's a it's a death defying feat of strength <laughs> yeah it's pretty nuts it sure is you guys and that's what i was telling you guys if you guys are action seekers or anything like that um it's worth it but if you're like me it is a little scary the black um, it is a little scary but like he was saying people do go with their bikes here walking it isn't as bad you just have to be really careful as to where you're stepping because you fall from here you could either die or just get really hurt right now i'll flip the camera and just kind of give you guys an angle of where our trucks are parked compared to where we're at so let me do that so you're going to notice way down there we're parked with the pink jeep tours like i told you guys if you guys are ever out here just get out of their way you know they're doing their business they're out here they have permission they're working so just don't get in their way as you can tell we parked kind of off to the side there but we're up here right now which is a spectacular view if you walk it but biking it something else so we're gonna take a quick break here, but we just wanted to kind of show you a little bit about it. We finished up the hike. Uh, right now we kind of came down a ways. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and now get to uh, Mushroom Rock. You guys will see it, it's epic. And like I said, we're doing Broken Arrow Trail and that's where it's at. So right now I have Steve kind of driving the truck just so I could get some awesome shots for you guys. So right now I'll have him pull forward and you guys are gonna see. It's probably not gonna show on the camera, but this little ledge here is quite straight up. So let's see how the truck does. Let's Now you can start going left. Made it to that point where the mushroom rock is. You guys are gonna see it. The views here are insane. You can either walk it like I'm doing, but it's better to do it with your vehicle, your four x four rig. Uh, it's an experience, that's for sure. Let's show you guys. So right about right here, uh, when the truck starts going up, if you have a Tacoma, it does get a little bit harder to see. Um, so if you're not that experienced, it's probably best to have a spotter right about this spot, just so you don't kill yourself and go off the ledge. You do not want that, of course, nobody does. Um, but yeah, so basically uh, what you got to do is go around that mushroom rock, which is what Steve's doing there. It's freaking awesome. Views are insane. Um, 
You guys you gotta check it out. So Steve's kind of hugging the wall a little too much, which is nothing wrong with that. Uh, but you do have a little bit of space, but it's better to be safe than sorry. That's basically what he's doing. But right when you finish up this edge right here, you're going to notice you open up to this nice, nice greenery with the red rock that Sedona is super famous for. As you guys can tell, the views are insane. Right now, we're going to go ahead and continue going up that way, which it's just going to be an endless trail of awesome looking views. Damn. As you guys can tell, right there is the mushroom rock. Right now, we're going to go ahead and come up with the trucks. It's going to come right about right here. And one thing that this place is famous for is right around this corner. And then also, we're almost to the devil staircase, which you guys, I think, will enjoy. It's not going to show as much on the camera, but if you guys have ever been here, you guys know how intense it is. And it's awesome. But right here, it's going to be a crazy climb. You guys will see it in a minute when they both come up. So let me bring him up, you guys. He's going to go up it right now. You guys will see how intense it is. Camera never just justice i don't know but here we go you guys check it out this is probably a spot if you guys do have a rear locker front locker whatever uh, go ahead and turn it on it'll help out there you guys go i don't know if you guys can tell the angle of that but that's pretty high up not yet Let's go ahead and now bring my truck in. Now we're gonna do it backwards before we take off and do this just for fun but and then we'll continue on to where I told you guys but check it out I wish you guys can see this in person it's just it's something incredible I'm gonna try to go on this side for you guys get a better shot before I get ran over right about there Let's check it out and insane incline is your butt puckering yet just a little bit. <laughs> So you definitely have to bring extra underwear if you guys do do this way. Uh, if you guys do do it backwards like this, it's a little intense. Damn. All right, Steve, go ahead and bring it down. Let's test it. Do it the same way he did. All right, so there it is, you guys. Hope you guys are enjoying this. I hope you guys can come one day and just give it a try. It's well worth the drive, even if you guys are far away. I guarantee you that. You know what I like you to do? I like you to back up. So, like I said, I'm not the one inside. Steve's the one driving right now. So, we gotta give him a little guidance. And, yeah. right now we finished up like I told you guys uh, we're gonna continue on but we saw a couple other rigs kind of coming up uh, so we're gonna watch them Once you come up this uh, you're gonna notice we have the trucks parked here so basically from here uh, we're gonna go ahead and kind of climb down we're gonna go a ways and then we'll hit the devil staircase which I'm pretty sure that's what broken arrow part of it is famous for which a lot of people know about um, and if you don't you guys will see it in a bit but like I told you guys and I always say this in every single video when I do these uh, you'll never get the true experience through the video unless you're actually here because you can't see the actual articulation over video you can't see how like steep things really are I'll try to get it for you guys but I guess only the people that have been here or will ever come here will actually know what it feels like hey Steve yeah. so how this one <laughs> so how do it feel okay yeah I think fun? my rev could have done it I think so we could have winched you <laughs> just kidding always when in doubt winch it out all right so be honest to the camera 
explain that little section coming down it was it better coming down better coming up I liked it more coming up coming up was it easier yeah yeah it was hard but easier right yeah it was just because right. I'm able to see what I'm doing better. And, and coming down I was telling them you probably have to bring a change of underwear is that correct uh, maybe two maybe two and another pair of socks so socks what you're saying is you pooped and peed in my uh, seat Oh, I did a lot more than just that. Okay, well, I'm glad you didn't roll it. That was the main thing. <laughs> just kidding. And check it out, you guys. If you guys do not have a 4x4 rig, that's who you guys should check out. Pink Jeep Tours. They're super awesome people overall. Right now we are at Devil Staircase. You guys are gonna see, like I had told you guys earlier, you might not be able to see it on camera correctly, but I'll try to capture it for you guys just so you get an idea. Oh, you're probably gonna end up bashing something. And right here, you just gotta take it nice and slow. As you guys can tell, you pretty much ride the brakes all the way down and you guys will be fine. I mean, I've done it with 33s on a two inch lift and I barely came close, but it's possible as long as you take it nice and slow. And then there it is, from the bottom. So like I told you guys, in person you're not gonna be able to see it, but in, I mean on camera you're not gonna be able to see it, but in person it's literally like a staircase just coming down. Stick to the left a little. Left? Yeah, a little. Right there. about your life and don't fuck this up. You could really get fucked up here. Especially on that top section. If you try to drive up it, it's like a gray area of momentum and going slow at the same time. If you're going too fast, you'll pop off those rocks and end up on your roof. And if you're going too slow, you'll never have the momentum to get there. So driving up it is difficult. And a pucker up moment for sure. Make sure to bring those extra underwear if you guys do go up it. <laughs> right? Stay out of my way. Heck yeah. So just to show you guys really quick, uh, like I had told you guys, you can't see it on the camera, but this is pretty steep up there. It's a nice little staircase. I guess that's why they call it the Devil's Staircase. Yeah, that top section is like 45 degrees. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I don't know if you heard him on the camera, but he said it's about 45 degree angle up there. Uh, but yeah, if you guys did enjoy today's quick little video, uh, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. Quick videos, like three hours, like four hours. <laughs>